Get ready, here we go. Okay, whatever I have, I have it right here. I got it right here. I'm making my way through these woods. I'm almost at my fishing destination. You gotta make sure you have a ton of bug sprays on because the mosquitoes are thick out here. But I got three rods. I've got my measuring stick. I've got live shrimp. And I'm gonna be using some artificial lures too, like this shallow water jerk bait right here. So we're gonna trek on. We'll be at my fishing destination in a minute and we're gonna see what kind of action we can get into. Look at how overgrown this trail is. I'm walking through this old road. You can see the old pavement down here, but this is just overgrown like crazy. So it's a lot of effort to get out here, but it's gonna be worth it. So I'm just cutting through these bushes, trying to find a path. It's not easy to get through here. I'll be out at my fishing destination shortly. You can hear how thick the bugs are. I'm surrounded by them right now, and they are loud. Okay, I just walked through the woods. I'm gonna try this spot right behind me to start. I'm gonna free line some live shrimp through here, see if I can get into anything right off the bat. But I wanna give that, look at that manatee across the way there. He's eating that bush, how cool is that? So he's right out of the water, and he's eating that tree, the leaves off the tree. It's pretty neat right there. Just making some water here. I tell you, hiking in here is really tiring with all this gear. It's hell of a workout. So I bring all this water. I'll probably drink through it by the time I'm out of here. So when you come out here, it's really important to also bring water, but I'm gonna burn through a lot of this by the time I'm out of here. So the gear is gonna be a lot lighter. Okay, I'm gonna start off by free lining a shrimp. Okay, we're gonna see what we can get right over here. Something moved right here. Test the drag, make sure the drag is set. Make sure everything's good. Cause you don't wanna screw up if you get one on. Okay, I cast right to where I saw one move. See if maybe we can get something right off the bat. And I tell you, is it a hot one today? So all that is is just free lining some shrimp. It's usually a good sign when the manatees are around, they keep the gators out of here. Okay, I, oh, he's off, okay, okay, that was, a, that was a nice hit, but I'm actually really surprised that he didn't get hooked. It might be time soon to change this leader too, it's pretty chewed up from the fish I caught, so I got a bite right there, I'm assuming that was a tarpon, but it didn't get hooked. It seem like a pretty good fish. Right there. There's a fish now. Something's tapping it. Get ready. Get ready. Get ready. Here we go. Okay, whatever I have, I have it right here. I got it right here. Might be a catfish, I don't know. Okay, what do we got here? Okay. Yeah, I think this is a bigger catfish, you guys. Oh, guys, we got a sail cat. 
we got a sail cat right out of here. Holy crap, man. Look at this. Wow. Let's pull him up. Oh, crap, man. Look at this, you guys. I mean, I've never caught a sail cat in here, but it's pretty nice. Look at this guy. Look at his mouth. Look at this one. Beautiful fish right there. I'm going to kind of stay away from him. Look at the slime on that leader from him. We'll get that off. I'm going to hit it right here. I don't want to get too close to those spikes, but he is a beauty. Look at the mouth on that thing. So let's throw him back. Nice sail cap. And then there he goes, just like that. Beautiful catch. I got excited for that because normally I'm just catching those other little crappy catfish, but that was a nice one. I do know some people that eat those. They bread them and they eat them. I tried it before in the past. It's actually, it's actually pretty good. Just want to get this slime off the hook. Okay, not a bad start. I'll take it for sure. Nice little catch. I'm gonna put it back in the same spot. I don't think that's what bit initially. Because uh, you can see the size of the mouth on that one. If that one bites, it's getting hooked. The other one really hit it hard. So something about this little corner here. There's a lot of fish biting right there. Okay, get ready. I think we got another one biting here already. I don't know what this is. Might be the shrimp too. There he goes, get ready. Oh, okay, hang on, hang on. Something just bit it right there. Oh, and he's off, okay. Good sign, good sign. That was kind of my mistake, I jerked it. Remember, I have a circle hook on, you have to reel, so your natural reaction is just to jerk back when all you have to do is reel with the circle hook. That's how you hook them, and it is hot as heck. Let's get it right back out there same spot we're gonna do it free line and shrimp oh that's a little off but that's okay I'm free line and shrimp with about a foot leader something just moved right there I'm a little farther to the right I'm trying to get it a little bit more to the left okay wait that might have been a bite Nice little bait fish swimming around in here. See the difference? Just a little bit over and nothing fighting. Get it back in the right spot. A little bit closer to those weeds over there. There we go, right there. That's exactly where we want it, right there. There's a bite. Little bite. Sometimes it could be the shrimp moving too. Oh, 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 okay, he might have, oh, oh, he might have taken it off that time. He might have taken it off that time. Okay, it's still there, still there. Let's try it again. Right there, right there. That's exactly where we want it. There he is, there he is. Oh, 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 that was a hit, okay. He's playing with it, playing with it. Oh, okay, okay, okay. He got it that time. Okay, let's try it again. The bite right now. Oh, he's on. Man, that's a tough fish to catch right there. It could be a sheephead or a snapper. Oh yeah, as you can see, he bit it right in half. That's a really good cast. That is right in there where they're all holding. There's a bite right now. Oh, 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 again, here we go. Oh shit. Oh shit. Man, they bite quick, so it's gotta be a snapper or a sheep head. Okay, I got one right here. I don't know what it is. Here it comes, and it's one of those snappers, just like I thought. And here he is right here. Okay, 
so that's what's been taken off the bait. What I like about this tall grass is as soon as I lay them down in here they usually calm down in the grass right away. So that's the good part about it. Okay there it's out. Okay we're gonna throw them back let them go right here. And there he goes, just like that. And he's coming up right here. There he is. That's going to do it for today. We're heading out of here now. It's extremely hot. It's one of those days again where it's close to 100 degrees. But we're going to head out. If you like to bike, hike, camp, cook, and fish, I incorporate all those into one. You'll get some great tips. If you like any of those items, subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you on the next great adventure.